Hello my dear beloved Laura and everyone else and welcome back to Dragon Age. So here we are and oh uh, I just realized that in the map uh, there is this quest markers that uh, tell me where things are. So that's a little sad I was about to set up for a search but no, it just tells me there. <laughs> I just randomly clicked on map. Here we are in Lothering, I wanted to say, and yet... Yeah, and here we can see the blight. Going up. So, uh, yeah, I think I wanted to press the journal and instead, uh, instead of the J, I pressed M. But yeah, impacted bears and find the orphan's mother okay so let's set out oh there are wolves now there they weren't there before okay and that and the uh, yeah talks between the um, women are pretty interesting yes yeah, I like to discuss something personal. Laura told me that you don't get that in the camp, but I don't want to discuss something personal with others around. Yes? Something you need? So yeah. Okay, so wolves. Well, let's try and engage them at our maximum uh, distance away. Okay, nice. Alistair, how about you stay behind? Make a breath. Okay. <laughs> okay, so that didn't work. Alistair, you can come in. No. I should like it. Okay, everyone else is running up to us now. But yeah, I mean, I don't think this war should be oh, yeah, much threat. Come on, keep shooting. Let's go, go quick shooting, right? Okay. Any bo boss? No, I don't see any boss. So let's just Pick one and no, not 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 one that's very weak. But yeah, you see Alistair with the heavy armor he's like having a field time. I don't even need to turn on uh, uh, this defensive ability, he is doing fine. The dogs are attacking more again. Are they still doing fine?
No, I wanted the other dog to be attacked. Well, Alistair, maybe it's now time to you do your shield defense. And yeah, maybe it's now my time to step in and help out. Ready! So let's do a stun. Okay. And just lighting a little bit the better ones. Got them almost. Yeah, I, I need to remember to use my uh, poison. Okay. Ah, uh, tis you. So yeah. Easy. And yeah, there's the corpse. And there is something else that I hope is not the boy, but yeah. Okay, and then uh, let's do the infected bears, which of course will be in the same spot here, where the spiders were, right? Yeah. Yep. Yes. I am ready. Ah. I'll just uh, wait a little bit. This one is running straight for me. Let's use a venom. Hurry. Ready. Hey, didn't I said you to use that? Okay. Is it difficult? But still, so how can we prove that we have killed this? I guess no way. No bear hide or anything to take from them. And yeah, the venom will get wasted, but that's okay. It's really not very useful. The spider carcasses are still here. Yeah, and can't slide down here, but we can here. Okay. So easy be easy.
Oh yeah, I'm alive again. We need to hide you. <laughs> there you go. Oh, I guess I wonder if they have. Yes. Something you need? Any chat when we get over this bridge because I detected that that's so always when they talk. will never get over how quietly you are able to move. It took me years and years to learn, and even then I am not the best at it. So you didn't sneak around when spying? We all had different ways of doing things. Some preferred not to be seen at all, to cloak themselves in shadow and darkness. I realize that it is not such a bad thing to be seen, as long as you do not stand out and are quickly forgotten. I specialize in blending in not drawing attention and looking like I had every right to be there. It is invisibility, but of another kind. Ah, yes, but I heard you often seduced your targets. They'd remember you. Not if they died. Oh. Oh, oh we said the same thing with Alistair. Dying well in the company of a lovely seductress. Tell me that isn't a good death. I don't know if I should take you seriously. But you scare me sometimes. Hmm. So that's why are you seducing me? I am one of your targets, eh, Laliana? <laughs> the path of righteousness is full of hardship, but the Maker smiles upon its travelers. And the stars stood still, the winds did quiet. And all animals of earth and air held their breath. All was silent in prayer and thanks. Yeah, I got fifty gold and an item. Old keeper, steel, long sword. Oh. Is there anyone I could give this weapon? I have the family sword, I will not keep it, and I don't have the strength. And yeah, here, here are the wardens, uh, long sword. This is actually better, wow. Yeah. Yeah, better damage, critical chance. Oh wow, so yeah, this is, uh, this is, uh, all, 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 all together superior in every way, this old keeper's sword. So, yeah, once, just like uh, his Templar shield is nothing very special, his ward and long sword is not very special either. Alistair. Yeah, it doesn't look special either. So yeah, I, I will give you because this is a better sword and, uh, yeah. It, it came from the chantry, so you might not like it that much. Yeah, it, it looks fancier too. Okay. And yeah, how about the hovers? Egg is... Yeah. Yeah, better missile uh, deflection and the chance to avoid missile attack, but he already have the shield cover for that. And spell resistance, that's something that his Templar shield should have, but this is just a shield basically. It doesn't have any Templar quality, just have the Templar symbol on it. This is more like a Templar shield than this is. Yeah, so yeah, but yeah, the Shield of Hyrule is a personal gift, and it has an attack bonus, so yeah, I will, and you can keep it. And the family longsword, should I consider swapping it for the Warden longsword? I am a Warden, too. No, my family sword is better, that's good, because I would not want to... Uh, Change it. Okay. Uh, so that was both of the quests. 
right? I think I got both. Uh, Oh, I'm paused. Well. I was thinking, why can't I, I walk? But yeah, this was a post. For a foundation built of stone, of the quest. Mob. Okay, so no or more quest. Any precious metal is worthless if faith in the maker is absent. So yeah, um, yeah. So we here have the lithium portion and the lesser injury kit, and so yeah, we now we can make these. So the question is, should we make this? We don't have immediate need for for it. So maybe we should keep uh, the ingredients since yeah, it seems like we need more and more to get to a higher level stuff. And yeah, instead of the living portion, there is the greater living portion. And I would think that you need to know how to make a living portion to know to learn how to, to make a great living portion. So I don't know, I will keep on because I don't have immediate needs for these. So yeah, um, I do wonder what happens if we go into the chance with the canary. Yes. So yeah, I will go in and see if I get any new uh, dialogue with the uh, Reverend Mother. What now? The Canari, out of its cage. Yay! Indeed. I would question this, but I have far more pressing matters to deal with. Misstep, creature, and it will be your last. A Kunari does not misstep. <laughs> it figures that you would be behind this. If the matter is important, certainly. Now, unless there's something else, travel safe. Okay, so yeah, that's amazing that we do get some extra from having the Kunari. You dare to bring that canary here? Get him out! <laughs> out! I sense I am unwanted. I only wish to talk. This is intolerable. Leave at once. Hmm. You dare to bring that canary here? I sense I am unwanted. This is intolerable. I sense I am unwanted. Well, we will go very like. Hmm. Not I think. sense I am unwanted. Thank you. We have enough troubles without having to face that creature again. Hmm. Okay. So yeah, that's all we get out of that. Well, I tried. Well, you can go back, go out in our... Vashadon. Indeed. Go out in our uh, camp. So yeah. Yes? So that means we have nothing more to do in the in lottering, it seems like. I already got this guy, Potter Bridge. So yeah, it seems like we can move on. Uh, let's check this merchant again if there is anything we can buy. Huh. Don't suppose you're looking to buy something. All right. That we could need. Yeah, the cold agent. That sounds like something we will need. Hmm. For poison making. And the dirt loot. Yeah. yeah, buy them seven silver. Toxin X that is not needed. Deep mushroom. 
yeah, get them. We are cheap and we probably will be of some use. Okay. So what's the deal with you and him anyway? What? Dare I ask? Him? Him who? Is this supposed to mean something to me? You know exactly who I'm talking about. Mr. Let's make kissy faces over there. My, my. You are jealous, aren't you? Did I take your favorite Grey Warden away from you? What? I'm not jealous. I'm horrified. <laughs> Those blushing cheeks of yours tell a different tale. These blushing cheeks are terrified that you'll suck all the blood out of them once you're finished with them. If I feel the need to suck on anything of yours, Alistair, you'll be <laughs> the first to know. That was so not what I meant. Perhaps we should go and tell him together about your touching concerns. Perhaps he'll pay more attention to you if you ask nicely. Uh-huh. I think we're done here. Done before you started, in fact. <laughs> Okay, what is the matter with you guys? Over standing three different ways and all. Oh, is this the boy? No. Okay, I thought. So yeah, probably the boy died. Yeah, I, I do wonder. Yes? Something you need? Yes? What's on your mind? So yeah, what, what with this bridge? It gives out conversations every time. Not this time, because probably there's a timer or something that makes it so that you can just run back and forth to get information. Uh huh, but yeah, if I go out here, this seems like to be to a separate area. With the music and everything, and what if I go back <laughs> down to this bridge? Hmm, what if the ch entering a different, yeah, the Chantry building, if that's something that triggers uh, uh, new dialogues. So le let's just go in. And it also seems like it matters who was the last person I was talking with. Cause this time it was Morrigan and so Morrigan was talking with Alistair. All right. So yeah, I'm trying to see if Larry and I have anything more to say or... Yes? Something you need? So yeah, let's see, let's see. You are very beautiful, Morrigan. Oh yes. Tell me something I do not know. But you are always dressed in such rags. It suits you, I, I suppose. A little hair here, a little rip there to show some skin. I understand. You understand I lived in a forest, I hope. Maybe we could get you in a nice dress one day. Silk. No, maybe velvet. Velvet is heavier, better to guard against the cold in Ferelden. Dark red velvet. Yes. With gold embroidery. It should be cut low in the front, of course. We don't want to hide your features. <laughs> your features. Stop looking at my breasts like that. It is most disturbing. You don't think so? And if it's cut low in the front, we must put your hair up. Show off that lovely neck. Yeah. You are insane. <laughs> I would sooner let Alistair dress me. <laughs> It'll be fun. I promise. We'll get some shoes too. <gasps> shoes. We could go shopping together. <laughs> Yes, yes, this is amazing. Well, Morrigan's hair is already up. So, yeah. That was amazing. <laughs> this is getting better and better. So, yeah, but there's the tavern here, too. If we need to trigger... What do you need? New dialogues. 
Yeah, I don't know how far do I have to venture out here. But yeah, last time I've been doing quest clear out, and then when I returned, the bridge provided new dialogue. Yeah, the chant going into the chantry and out seems like a good bet at getting something out of them. As you desire. <laughs> and so I shall. So who should I? Yeah, Lariana. Yes. Something you need. Or Morrigan? Yes. Let's see if Morrigan can bicker with Lariana some more because <laughs> it's fun. So I take it you did not enjoy your Templar training. Hmm. Well, that's directed at me. I take it. Do you see any others about who have failed at their religious instruction? I didn't fail, I was recruited into the Grey Wardens. And if you had not been recruited, what would have happened instead? I would have turned into a drooling lunatic, slaughtered the Grand Cleric and run through the streets of Denham in my small clothes, I guess. Your self-awareness does you credit. I thought you'd like that. Let's see if the tavern does the uh, same trick. And also I can see if there is anything else. I can check out the merchant in here. And the bartender. Donald. What can I get you then? Any humor? Oh. Nothing, of course. Well, I still don't have food to sell. Let's see if you have anything. Yeah, more plus than we ever need. Okay. isn't even really any dark spawn down south. It's all Grey Warden work. They're a devious lot, that's for sure. Okay, um... Neighbor fled the city yesterday. Thinking of going myself. Where to? They'll stop those dark spawns soon enough. What do you need? Let's see if there's anything Alistair can... ...say? So, let me get this straight. You were a cloistered sister? You must have been a brother before you became a Templar, no? I never actually became a Templar. I was recruited into the Grey Wardens before I took my final vows. Do you ever regret leaving the Chantry? No, never. Do you? Yes. You may not believe it, but I found peace there. The kind of peace I've never known. It used to get so quiet at the monastery that I would start screaming until one of the brothers came running. I would tell them that I was just checking. Oh, you never know, right? I... no, I never did anything like that. I enjoyed the quiet. See yourself. The look on their face was always priceless. Huh. Alistair the Comedian. So yeah, it seems like that we run out of the bickering between Morrigan and Laliana. And who knows, maybe I'm not supposed to go back and forth to trigger all this conversation. Maybe, you know, this way I will run out of them by the end of the game. <laughs> I don't know. But these are fun and I am having fun doing this. So 
for you, Laliana. Yes? Something you need? I would like if you would talk some more. Do you have any tales of the wild? None of the sort you like. No princesses in tall towers or knights throwing themselves at whole armies. That's not all I like. Do you want tales of the chastened wilders who dwell in the marsh? Do you want to hear of the slow deaths they inflict on their enemies? Perhaps a tale of the poisonous creatures of the wilds that lay their eggs on your skin so their young may eat you alive when hatched? Or a tale of my mother's marsh cuisine? That, in my opinion, is the most terrifying <laughs> of all my tales. Uh, no, I don't want to hear about those things. Then I have no tales for you. Okay, so yeah, at least they are no longer bickering with each other. So yeah, I guess this is the time to leave Lotharin then. There's not much left here. So yeah, the trap maker we cannot have with, but that's okay. I would find it awfully unlikely that that's what matters if we can get them that uh, traps. Okay, so yeah, we can move on, right? Are you sure, Ishti? Yes, I am pretty sure we can move on. But that, of course, will be the next episode. Can't and this in in here. Yeah, it's a pity I never got to get into this building. That would be nice. Why can't I get into here? I thought that there would be a quest leading in here and there would be... I don't know. Um, some sort of enemy inside. But no. Okay. Well then, this is it for now. I hope you've been having fun. I've been having fun. See you next time. Bye bye.